And I have a poem I wrote that I would like to read, and it's called The Harvest. All right. Okay, since I think uh, the harvest is getting very, very close, guys. Oh, yes. Really well now. Okay, here we go. I believe in all miracles that I might know the Creator. As Him and me, and me and Him, we can do mighty feats together. Our love combined will leave none behind. For we appreciate the times we are in, that we should win and conquer sin. The wheat, the tares, the fire consumes the shaft, burning with vengeance for those with no repentance. Message after message from the heavenlies above, why did they wait as it became much too late? Putting on the mask of our righteousness to ease the woes, what will become of us who never bent our knees for the one true God? Mm. Deep in the wells of living waters flow, cleansing the earth bringing up new and vibrant land for those who praise this man, knowing that our salvation is acknowledging he exists and always has. Certainly, we don't blame us fully, for the lives have been many, governments creating false narratives, timelines, and subterfuge. We have never been told the truth of our creation. Why is this? It's always been hard to play the game, never having received the rules. Now, giving honor to the one who had created me, I thank him with love. Knowing now that I am on the path that was always created for me, following the Savior for my salvation, I bend that knee in humility. You see, our Creator wants you now, in his fold, become part of his life. He says it's never too late. Heaven's gates await, even the late. Mm.